whether their ability is good or not, it depends on whether these four years we can provide them sufficient platforms or not. That's very important. After I finished my high school, I spent about four years in the Hong Kong Aircraft Engineering Company as a craft appendage. Within that four years, I received a full training on how to repair the aircraft. That four years actually helped me a lot, particularly for my teaching now. Aircraft is kind of product, but that is only bigger. Then now, so what you talk about product design, a lot of people will feel their hair dryer, mobile phone, but that's a smaller one. But in reality, the knowledge behind will be the same. If you can start from the first two lectures to tell them about the real life examples, why the problem happened in the world, and they know how to use the equation to solve the problem, then they will build up their interest to learn. But if you really show something valuable in the class, the student they feel why they have to learn, then they will come to the class. So that's the reason why normally I don't take any attendance. I always tell the students, okay, just follow my lecture notes to study. You may not either get past. But what I'm showing in the class, what I discuss with you, those are questions were in the exam. No people are there to absent and no people are there to sleep. Not only because uh, they want to drop down what Ellen say, but we also we also think that it's very interesting. He's a really passionate teacher and also that he, is, he can motivate the student to um, deliver the best of themselves. Ellen came to appoint some class captain or group leader, so he's picking, appointing those active students to take up these roles to help the less, comparatively less active students to be more committed. No, I only have two hobbies. One is uh, doing physical exercise, and the other is uh, start from when I was a child, is uh, reading comics books. There's a lot of comics books talking about the Chinese history. Normally, I would buy the real history book and then try to compare it, and then try to understand about the real history. And no matter what kind of product you design, you have to look at the market. Why comics book is a so big market? It's because the people, they have a lot of leisure time. It's become a hobby. So this is the kind of thing they have to learn about the what is a market. He always organized some competitions and industrial visits for us so we can have more experience and more contact with the reality instead of only on the books. When you are learning in the university, okay, you are not just looking for your score. What else you want to look for? But the outcomes, okay, what you learn, really learn. Based on their design mindset, entrepreneurial mindset, engineering knowledge. So after the student gets through all this kind of training, they really have to make a product. We have a lot of great design ideas that came out. When we were in the classroom setting, they are really students. But once they are outside of the classroom settings, they're like experimenters. I felt very happy, you see. The senior management that company, they are so appreciative. We can train those students, can they do product design, engine design, and they know a bit about the marketing of the product as well. The most important is that we have to keep our alumni relations very close. And then they will constantly will tell you about what is the new development in the industry. And then we best you this to teach our students. You get closer link with the industry because you want to get more information about the real practice in the industry. This kind of information can be used for teaching. You have to do research because you have to keep constantly telling the students about the new technology in the world. And we are not just teaching, we are providing a platform for them to learn about themselves, provide more opportunity for them to know something new about the industry, about the knowledge in the textbooks, and also we all want them to have idea in mind that there's a lifelong learning is very important.